YouTube, what is good? Hey, it's been a minute since I gave you guys a 360 video. Now I'm trying something out, all right? I'm bringing these 360 waves back because unfortunately, you guys love the waves, all right? You guys love the 360 videos, the how-tos. This started as a fitness channel and I was hoping y'all wanted to make some gains, but it looks like people are more attracted to the waves than they are the gains. So, hey, look, I'm gonna do both, all right? So I'm gonna give y'all a 360 wave and I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a fitness video. So if you are my fitness subscriber, if you do wanna get that, those tips on how to build muscle, how to get lean, go ahead and click on my uh, fitness videos. I have them, all right? This channel started as a fitness channel and it still is, but you know, unfortunately you know, on the waves, they spend it under here in this do-rag. So uh, I gotta give my tip. I'm all about helping, right? So if I can put, put you guys on game and show you guys how to make games and how to get 360 waves, hey look dog, I'm gonna do it, all right? So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what we looking like under the rag. I haven't been too consistent, you know, with my brushing and all that. And if you know, if you wanna get these 360 waves, you have have to brush you gotta be consistent you gotta eliminate the forks you gotta comb you gotta wash you gotta get it in all right so like i said have not been the most consistent but i'm trying to get back into it guys i'm trying to bring it back all right so i've been brushing i've been washing i've been getting it in all right so let me go ahead and show you guys what we're looking like oh there we go man we're still looking all right. We're not looking, we're not looking too bad. I still been brushing, don't get it twisted. I just said I wasn't consistent. You can see the forks. I got forks all up and through here. But it's all good. My crown isn't the best either. I haven't been training it at all. But I'm telling you guys, I'm trying to bring it back, all right? All right, so anyways, the purpose of this video, man, is to just show you guys how I moisturize my hair. One of the key things of 360 Waves is you have to moisturize your hair. I don't care what type of style your hair is, whether it's coarse, whether it's, you know, medium, or maybe long hair, I think, that's, I think those are the names. I know I'm a coarse hair waver, more on the nappier side, you know what I'm saying? So uh, moisturizing is something that you just have to do. You know, keep your hair moisturized, keep the moisture, keep it moist, you know what I'm saying? So that's like one of the key things, you know? Ditch the pomades, you know what I mean? You do not have to overload and use so many pomades and just coat your hair up. It's not good for the pores, all right? It's not good for, you know, uh, growing that healthy hair. So what you want to do is find you a nice moisturizer and get on it, all right? Moisturize your hair. Maybe out of seven days out of the week, you should be moisturizing maybe three to four, you know what I'm saying? And that's minimum, all right? So currently here is the moisturizer that I am using right here as I am the double butter cream right here. Uh, it's real good, man. It smells good. And, uh, uh, just overall, man, it's a, it's a real decent product. You know, it doesn't give me the most shine, but I use oil as well to help with that shine. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I apply the moisturizer. Just simply grab me some right there, rub it in. And just throw it on. I can feel my hair getting soft. Cause that's what you want guys. You want your hair to be soft, all right? So once you get your product in, you got your moisturizer up in there, your hair is nice and soft. Now you gotta get you a soft brush, all right? So I'm currently uh, being more on the cheaper side. I got this uh, from a um, beauty supply store. This is the, uh, the Bow Wow version of the Curve uh, type style, which is really ideal, man. This Curve, no matter what it is, that Curve, man, does something good to the waves. But uh. Yeah, you definitely want to brush it in with a nice, softer brush. I go back and forth, you know, I might go soft brush, medium brush, soft brush. Yeah, guys, you just get in there. Get your nice brush session in. Let's say anywhere from, you know, five to 10 minutes.
Like I said before, I have not trained my crown as much as I should. So normally when I'm just brushing like this, I kind of avoid it just a bit. So that's what you want to do, man. You want to put, put your moisturizer in. You want to keep your hair moisturized. That's ideal, man, for all waivers. For all my 360 waivers, anybody trying to get 360 waves, you have to moisturize your hair. So after I get a couple, you know, strokes in with the soft brush, I'll go ahead and switch it up. I got a nice medium brush right here, nothing fancy. Again, this is more on the cheaper side. This is not your Royalty or your, your Torino or nothing like that, all right? It's just a standard brush and I get it in, you know? So don't get, don't get it twisted, guys. I still brush my hair. I'm just not as consistent, like I said. So my brush sessions, you know, at nighttime, might range anywhere from, let's say, 10 to 15 minutes, if that, you know. Like I said, I wanna get better, and seems like you guys on YouTube love the wave videos. So with that being said, you're gonna get more of these wave videos, especially if you keep liking and subscribing. So that's why I moisturize my hair, guys. I pretty much just get the brush session in. I get it in until, you know, the hair starts to dry up. Basically, my hair has soaked up all that moisture, you know, to the scalp. And so my hair, you know, and it's gonna, gonna create those nice 360 waves, man. Get me how I need to get, all right? So uh, that's the cream right there. And then what I do after that, I throw on some oil. So I'm currently using this oil right here. This is gonna be good for the frizz, for that new growth. Uh, just overall, man, for the scalp, it helps with the itching and all that, because I know you guys, hair is, itchy and your scalp is itchy you know but uh to eliminate that just wash more possibly but then again you don't really want to be washing your hair too many times you know once a week if you're a real sweaty individual twice a week you know what i mean so i normally wash once a week you know on a weekend maybe on a sunday and uh good enough but i still get this in real good product i've been using it so far it's good for curls and if you know your waves are curls laid down all right this is all it is right here Get your nice, get your nice bit, rub it in just like you did your moisturizer. Now after I get that oil in, I grab the even softer brush. This is like ultra soft right here, all right? So this is actually the brush that I wash my hair with. So you already know if you wash your hair and brush um, and brush with your wash, it softens up the brush. So this brush right here is like super, super soft. So again, I just go in. So by the time you finish with uh, this method right here, just moisturizing and uh, putting the oil in, you have brushed your hair for about at least 20 to 30 minutes guys and that is an ideal brush session for our waiver look guys i'm just here trying to put you guys on bone game all right Don't forget to bag it up. All 
All right, guys, after I bag it up, I'll go ahead and use one of these wipes on my forehead. I mean, you've been putting moisturizer on your forehead by brushing and all that, so uh, you definitely want to clean that dirt off your forehead. And I say dirt, but I really mean you just want to clean off that product. These wipes are known to lift the dirt off your face. This is why I say dirt. But if you notice, you know, once you wear that do-rag for a long time or just overall over the years, you get a ring on your forehead, which I am still in the process of getting rid of from wearing my do-rag the improper way. I've actually put a video up not too long ago, uh, well actually it wasn't a long time ago, but it was about, you know, how to rag up. So uh, maybe I'll throw another one in, you know, 2020. Show you guys how you should be wrapping up your do-rags, tying up your do-rags. But yeah, just want to wipe that product off, you know. Keep your forehead clean up. You also want to be washing your do-rags as well. There's a lot of things that you should be doing as a waiver to make sure you're just overall in good health. Sometimes you gotta rock that cape out, you know what I'm saying? All right, YouTube, hope you guys like this video, man. Just a quick tutorial on how to keep your 360 waves moist, all right? <laughs> how to keep that moisture. You gotta keep your waves moisturized if you wanna really develop some nice 360 waves, all right? But you also gotta keep brushing. At the end of the day, none of this really matters if you're not brushing, all right? So make sure you're getting those brush sessions in and getting these waves, all right? Get your hair laid down with the do-rag and watch it work, all right? So, hey, I appreciate you guys for rock with me. Go ahead and like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed already. I got more content coming for you. Hey. If you guys want to get yoked and get strong, click on one of these uh, fitness videos that I got. I got fitness tutorials for you guys. I'm showing you how to eat. I'm showing you how to live. I'm showing you how to make gains, all right? So we're going to make gains up here, and we're going to make gains right here, all right? So, hey, keep it locked on the channel. Subscribe. Thank you for watching. Catch you guys in the next one.